Good evening, teacher. Hey. How are you? I'm all right, and you? Fine, thank you. All right. Hello, Erica. Hello, good night. Actually, good <laughs> yeah, good evening. Do you know what's the difference between good night and good evening? Mm. Mm. So. <laughs> Actually, good night is pretty much to say bye bye. Okay. Oh, well. Yeah. Because in Spanish, it's different because in Spanish, when you go to a place, buenas noches, hi, hi. In English, you say good evening. Okay. Perfect. Thank you. Yeah, no problem. <laughs> and when you say, like, when you're leaving, okay, people, bye, good night. Okay. And yeah, good evening. Good, hi, good evening, everybody. All right, Guillermo. Hey, Eduardo, I want to hear you today. Do we even need to say, do, do we hear me well now? Because I I change my earphones. I hear you much better. Yes. Okay. Yeah. Well, thank you. Hello, welcome class. How is everybody? Fine, teacher. Fine, fine, fine. fine. Mm -hmm. Thank you. All right. Wow, Erica, you like the color red. <laughs> Sorry. You like the color red. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I have never seen a red room. <laughs> That's cool. <laughs> it's my kitchen. Oh, it's your kitchen. That's so cool. <laughs> That's nice. Yeah. All right. Thank you. Where, where do you live? Y mexicanos, residencial San Pedro. All right, cool. Yeah. All right, let me see everybody's in. Ovidio. Laura is here. Hi, Laura. Uh, Laura, I'm sorry, were you in class yesterday? Yes. Oh, yes, yes, you were. Yes, you were. I'm sorry. Yes. Now I recognize you. Juana, hi. Hi, teacher. How are you? I'm fine, thank you. How are you? Fine. Very, very good, teacher. How was your Tuesday? Mm, nice, nice. Uh, without problem. All right. Kelly, thank you. Welcome. Kelly Mesa. How come I have two Kelly Mesas? Sorry, I'm, I am late. Oh, okay, no, no problem, no problem. Now, okay, now I only see one. We have Gladys and Rosibel. Glad All right, good. Hello, There's good evening, everyone. Good evening. So tell mm -hmm. me, is there something new? Is there something special that happened today? Uh, not much. No, I have uh, more work to do than yesterday. <laughs> Okay. I went to Santa Ana. The traffic was okay. Um, oh, because oh yeah, you have to see all all the. You have to see all the. The, textile industries, right? Yes. Yes, teacher. Okay, so I'm going to share my screen. Mm. Hold on, let me see if we're here. We're going to study about gerunds and infinitives. Okay. Okay, let's go. Do you know what is um, a gerund and an infinitive? Oh. Mm. Gerund I'll make it and inf yeah, I'll make it simple. Okay. Infinitive, I like to eat pupusas. Infinitive, I like to drink coffee. Infinitive, I like to play with my son. Infinitive. Mm -hmm. This gerund is I like eating pupusas. I like 
drinking coffee and I like playing with my son. So what do you see as the difference right there between infinitive and, ger and gerunds? The verb plus ing. Exactly. Yeah, and in the, in the mom infinitive. The word to and the verb in the base form. The simple form. Very good, okay, then we're good. All right, let me share my screen with you. Do you see my screen? Yes. 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 yes, teacher. Okay, tell me, can you hear? Gerons and infinitives. Yes. Okay, I press play. Please tell me if you can hear. Not yet. Welcome to Advanced Module 2. In our first topic, yes. we go over All right. infinitive okay. and gerund phrases. All right, let's listen to we this. We have studied this before, but don't worry. We'll explain it again so you feel comfortable with it. It plus be plus adjective or noun plus infinitive phrase is often used to comment on behavior. These sentences can also be restated with gerund phrases. It's rude to ignore your conversation partner. It's a good idea to try out different topics. Ignoring your conversation partner is rude. Trying out different topics is a good idea. The word considered may also follow in this kind of sentence. Is considered impolite to interrupt people. Interrupting people is considered impolite. These sentences can also include the phrase for plus person or pronoun. It's customary for the complimentary to say nice things about others. Saying nice things about others is customary for the complimenter. We will begin our explanation by reminding you that gerunds and infinitives are both verbals. In other words, verbals are words formed from a verb but functioning as a different part of a speech, usually a noun. Gerunds are formed adding an ing ending and infinitives are composed of two plus a verb. In the structure just presented above, it becomes the subject of the sentence in the infinitive phrase, and ignoring, trying out, interrupting and saying are gerunds acting as subjects as well. Notice there's no changing meaning. Look at the following chart. Read it and decide whether they are using infinitive or gerund phrases. Okay, here is kind of read. yeah, it's kind of difficult because you can't read. Yeah, that's a yeah. problem. But don't worry, but we, we can we, we can do it ourselves right now. We can improvise. Okay. Okay, so let's do, I like, let's do a round of infinitives. So can you tell me, uh, Katia, Katia, I'm sorry, Katia Monches, can you give me an example of I like? An infinity, right? Yes. Mm -hmm. I like to listen music. Very good. I like to... Okay. Um, Kathy here, she touched a very important um, detail here. Yep. I think, I don't know if I told you this yesterday about listen, look, and talk. Yeah. Sense. Yeah. Sense. yeah. Sense. Sorry. Sorry. Okay. No, no, it's okay. So, yeah. So here mm -hmm. you need a preposition, another two. So go, Kathy. Another? No, no, can you repeat? I like to listen to music. Okay, I like to listen to music. All right, what music do you like to listen to? Most of all for the 80s, 90s. All right, good. English or Spanish. Mm -hmm. What about you, Eduardo? Can you tell me in negative, I don't like to? Okay. Uh, I don't like to eat. Uh, I don't like to eat cold food. I don't like to eat cold food. Okay, I understood. I don't like to eat cold food. Cold food. No, cold. Cold, cold food. 
Cold. C O L D. Cold. 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 Cold food. No, cold. C O L D. Yes, cold food. Oh, yeah. yeah, I don't like to eat cold food. Okay, very good. Hey, but sometimes pollo campero and pizza is good cold. No, pollo I campero, don't. no. no <laughs> pizza, no. yes. No, yeah. pollo campero, I like, like cold. I like the, the pizza like cold, the but pizza not the pollo campero. Pollo, campero. <laughs> pollo campestre. <laughs> Wait a minute. Who is single here? Who is single? Mm. single? You're single? Do you live alone? Yes. No. Oh. When you live alone, you learn to eat cold food. <laughs> <laughs> I remember when I was single and I lived alone and I was hungry and nobody else. Oh, man. And you, you open the refrigerator and oh my God, I only have one piece of pollo campero and I have to warm it up and wash this and that. Ah. Yeah. Cold. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, what? <laughs> Yeah, okay, good. Uh, Brian, can you tell me something you enjoy? Okay. I enjoy to assist to my Chinese classes. Oh, really? good. Mm -hmm. it's, a, it's an example. I, I <laughs> use it to... to you don't speak Chinese. In a school, they, they teach uh, Chinese, but it's a little difficult. Wait, in what learn. school do they teach you Chinese? Mm. In which Sorry? School? Sorry? In which school do they teach you Chinese? Uh, it's a it's a private school, but uh, it's not to recognize. Okay. Can mean you like say something in academy, Chinese? Uh, yeah, is it is it a normal school or is I it a language academy? Chinese. <laughs> uh, it, yes, it, it's a normal school. And oh, really, what I what I just well, what is the name is, of that school? It's uh, <laughs> Colegio Naciones Unidas. Ooh. Oh, oh, cool. Oh, okay, cool. wait a minute, wait a minute. So it's not directly Chinese. Chinese. They teach you many languages. Uh, first the English, uh, sign languages, and Chinese. That's Do you so know sign language? But I forgot it because I don't practice too much. Ah, okay. That's the bad point. I only know my name. <laughs> <laughs> Interesting. Yes. You know, talking about sign language, one time I saw, I saw Latenchis doing sign language. <laughs> it was so funny because, you know, <laughs> it was on a TV show when they were talking. Okay, can you say something in Chinese, Brian? Uh, I just remember to say hi. Ni hao. Ni hao. Ni hao. Um, ni hao. That's all you remember? That's all I remember. It's... Okay. I don't practice. So I don't leave the school. I don't think you enjoyed to go then. <laughs> No, <laughs> that's why it was an example. <laughs> All right, okay, good. Okay. Thank you. Okay, okay Ovidio, tell okay. me something you don't enjoy. I don't enjoy to play basketball. Good. You don't like that's to play so... basketball? No, no, not much. I enjoy to play soccer. All right. Okay. <laughs> okay, Janita, tell me something you love, but what is the difference between I like and I love? Um, I don't know what is the difference, but I think uh, love if you like too much. Yeah. I think the difference the is level, expression. I really, really like. It's the just level expression. Of the feelings. <laughs> yeah. yeah, it's just expression. It's like you're saying, oh man, I love chocolate. You can be well, very formal and say, and say, I like chocolate. Or you can say, man, I love chocolate. I don't like chocolate. <laughs> you, like <laughs> you wish a lot something or somebody? I don't yeah, but, know. Yes, I love. But yes, but it's more like in an expression, you know? Oh. Mm -hmm. Like, oh, man, I love eating crepas, chocolate. <laughs> cream. So, yeah. Okay, so tell me something you love, Janita, in infinitive. Well, I love to share time with my family. 
Good. I love to share time with my family. Very good. Is your family big or small? My family is big. I have uh, five siblings. Um, all of they are married and they have three children, everyone. Wow. I have a lot of nephews and nieces. Do you give them all something in Christmas? No. Okay, good. When, <laughs> when they was, it was a little child, yes. But in this time, they are, most of them are, are I don't know. They're old. They're they big are now. Old, are older, yes. They're, I, okay. only give, I only give a presents to the, the, the children. The children, yes. So you have the five sib you have five siblings and with you is six. Yes. Oh. Are you married? I am the last one. Oh, are you married? No, I am single. And do you have Two children? Singles. No, I don't have children. Oh, so you're 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 the last one. Yes, I'm the last one. <laughs> Does it bother you that everybody tells you? When? When? <laughs> no, no, I understand, but you know, I, I got yeah, I got married when I was 37, no, 35. Mm -hmm. Yes, when, but it's true. Everybody say you when, when, when. You are not in a hurry. <laughs> yeah, you know, and I remember like the Ten years before that, everybody was telling me, hey, he was, what do you think? What are you thinking, man? Yes. But, I, <laughs> but, you know, I mean, I, I think I got married in a perfect age because um, I did everything. And <laughs> now I am, uh, my life is my family. And mm -hmm. I don't like, I have a lot of friends that they, they like to go out and do this and do that and all. For me, a, a day off is to be with my son. I'm, I'm the happiest person. Mm. That's great. If but if I have time to go everywhere, yes, and spend time with every everybody. I think. Yes, that's why. That's that's what I told you. I lived alone for many many years, so I did everything bad you can imagine. <laughs> oh, <laughs> to enjoy a lot before. <laughs> yes, yes, I. I I, I am the Frank Sinatra song. I did it my way. <laughs> oh. <laughs> but but I do remember my family. Like, hey, when are you getting married? When are you getting married? And, and the worst thing was that all my brothers were married. Mm. He was? He was? Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> all right. So that's something you love. Now, Juana, can you tell me something you hate? Uh... I hate to to listen to bad words. Okay. Mm. Okay. And That's I, I I totally understand you. All right, good. Kelly, hi. Kelly, that's a. What? <laughs> Sorry. No, it's okay. Hello, Kelly. How are you? Okay, fine, fine, thank you. All right, Kelly, can you tell me something you like? Mm, I like it um, sushi. I like to example. eat sushi. I like to eat sushi, for example. What is your favorite sushi? Oh, well, I, I like, uh, uh, for example, uh, Californian roll and also like uh, eat, uh, let me see, uh, chicken, uh, fried chicken sushi. Good. Have you ever eaten the Salvador, Salvadorian roll? No, I haven't. <laughs> I, I have only eaten, eaten that in Super Selectos. Oh. Because you know, there are some Super Selectos that they make you yes, the sushi. Yes. They prepare, yeah. yes. But you know, it was very good because you know what they put? Well, the typical the typical ingredients of sushi, right? Okay. But they, 
<laughs> yeah, rice. But when what they actually put is um, of course the rice and everything, and then they start spreading spread beans, mm -hmm. avocado, avocado, okay. and, avocado. and plantain. Mm -hmm. Okay. And platan. I just try with the plantain, but at Suchito, they have that one. Oh, okay. Yeah, and then I really liked it. It was very good. <laughs> because I love that combination of plantain and, and beans. I always like that. Uh, uh, teacher, what is the difference in banana and plantain? It's the same. Can I use the two words? Banana is guineo. Plantain oh, is okay. platano. Oh, okay. Thank you. And... To be honest, I do not know what the difference is. <laughs> la, la banana is the small one, and the platane is the big one. Mm, okay. Banana uh, split, no platane. Yeah, but, no yeah. platane. Okay. That, that taste right. is different. Oh. Yes. Yeah. All right, Guillermo, what's up? Hi, sir. How are you today? Yeah, I'm great. Thank you for asking. You work in, in concentrics, right? Yeah. And what time That's do right. you work? From what time to what time? Um, my shift is from 7 a.m. to 5 p.m. and weekends off. Oh, cool. You have the perfect shift. Yeah, actually, I do. <laughs> I think I'm a lucky man. Oh, yeah. Because some people mm -hmm. have the night shift. Like, I had some students before that. Oh, they told yeah, me, come on. They yeah. tell me, oh, after this class, I start my shift. Oh. Yeah, most of Terrible. the time I have That's very sad. bad shifts, but I I think that I'm I'm so lucky because I have the chance to be there in that account, which is actually very very uh, quiet. I mean, it's very easy, easy going. Yeah, yeah, easy going. Yeah, easy going. Yep. All right, Gladys. Hello, Gladys. Yeah, hello. You know, Gladys, you look like a. Your your window, it looks like a scary movie. <laughs> yeah. So it's, like, it's because I no 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 it's I cool no it, it it's actually cool you know, like when you wake up and you see somebody in in, in your room, it's like, whoa, <laughs> uh, that's okay. cool. I like it. Yeah, Gladys. I don't have light. So that light is from your cell phone? It's from, uh, it's from uh, uh, a desk window, a desk, sorry, a desk lamp, and it's connected to the other room. Wow, but it, it, it looks, I, I like the look. It looks cool. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Thanks. All right, now let's, let's change to gerunds. Now don't tell me I like two. Now tell me I like with a gerund. Tell me something you enjoy. Okay. Um, um, well, I, I, let me ask you. Uh, you 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 live by downtown, right? Uh, yeah, actually, it's in like I said, in the center of San Salvador because it's not actually in the downtown. Like it's next to. Do you know Terminal Occidente? Mm, it's not in the town. Yeah, oh, yeah, that's what I said. Terminal de Occidente. Center. Yes. Yeah. Mm -hmm. oh, yeah. Boulevard uh, Venezuela. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Uh, that's uh, not downtown. Yeah, yeah, that's mm. what I said. The it's center, outside, yeah. outside downtown. I was thinking yesterday, where do you live? In downtown San Salvador? Mm -hmm. You know, like, because for me, downtown is like, so you live by Bul Bul uh, Venezuela, Boulevard, Santa Anita, and all that. Mm, let me see the cemetery. Yeah. 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 Um, more or less. And you make you make handcraft, correct? Yeah, exactly. What what do you make exactly? Uh bracelets. Bracelets. What kind of bracelet? 
uh, the ones that are made uh, of, well, I don't remember the word for ilos, a thread, thread, no. Mm -hmm. Is that thread, ilos? No. Thread, yes. Yeah, right. Yeah, threads. And also uh, beads, uh, mustasia, beads. I think that, that's beads, the yes. Yeah, beads. Do you enjoy uh, doing, you, do you enjoy making the handcraft bracelets? Uh, like it's my job, so <laughs> a part <laughs> of it, I enjoy it. Like, I, because it's, uh, I don't know how to explain it. Some kind the, of the payday, right? bracelets are easy to make them. And then from the other, and in the other hand, I'm earning money, so. Of course. Yeah. But you know what's interesting though? That you work for a company. Yeah, but I work at home because the company is actually not from here, El Salvador. It's uh, an American company. And they oh. sell it uh, by internet uh, all over the world. That's so interesting. Oh, cool, yes. That I, I have never heard that because yeah. the, the reason why I was going to tell you is because I know that the majority of people that make handcraft is that they do it themselves. To sell. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, because it's not like that. It's not like the people that work that, that make them like in, in the uh, touristical places or in the mar mar in the how do you say mercado sorry market 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 with the, in the market yeah it's uh this kind of, of job that you work for a company so do you have like um do you have like metrics they tell you hey i want you to make 10 a day 100 a day or yeah definitely actually they how, how do you say imponer like i mean they the they push. tell you yeah, they, they push the employees to- They to give you metrics. To, it's called metrics. Yeah, so. yes, exactly. Yeah, they give you these high metrics that you have to follow. And if you don't, <laughs> then you uh, get fired. Yeah, is but it, like- Is it difficult? Yeah, it depends on, yeah. I mean, that every every job is difficult in, in its own way, but like, like I already said, I work uh, from home. So I can also um, teach other people. And so they can help me to do the, to make the bracelets and I pay them. So hey, yeah, it depends. good idea. <laughs> yeah, exactly. So actually it depends on how do you like to work? Because I mean, I just uh, do the easiest and the prices and the prices uh, bracelets and I give uh, my holds uh, the difficult ones. Do you have little oh. brothers or little sisters? Yes, I do. Uh, oh man, I would my... do that. Do all my little brothers <laughs> and sisters buy a deli? Go. <laughs> How many? Them. Yes. Yeah. How yeah. many bracelets do you make per day? It depends on the difficult difficulty of the bracelet yeah okay. some for example one bracelet like it takes me like two hours and a half and oh. the easiest i i do i make uh a hundred in six hours for example it depends wow. on the bracelet wow okay yeah can you show us someday one of the bracelets you you make <laughs> yeah i was going to ask you that yeah, yeah, I'm so <laughs> interested in that. <laughs> we want to, to okay. see them. Uh, right now, I'm doing one that the name of it is Tejida. Um, uh, oh, nice. Uh, let me, I don't know. Okay, you, you, can, can, you can order some of them if you want. Like. Yeah, <laughs> this one. Yeah. It's, and, it's difficult. And the company yeah, this, from the United States. Yeah, yeah, the company is from the USA. That's so, that's interesting. I met a group of Venezuelan people here that do that. Yeah, they're, yeah, I am. Uh, actually, dark. I was watching a, a, a tourist, a, a woman that she was traveling around the world. And actually, she was here in El Salvador buying 
Uh, have you seen these uh, necklaces that are really big and they are made of beads, like little beads? Yes. But they are really um, exuberante. Yeah, they're um, really, really big. Yeah, and yeah, they're really big. And she, she's a Venezuelan, but that's just how you say it. She's from Venezuela. Yeah, Venezuela. and yeah, and she she buys uh, those necklaces here in El Salvador because they are because it's not a good uh, it's not well paid here in El Salvador, right? So mm -hmm. she uh, buys them here and she sells them in, in in Venezuela because the people there really likes it. Oh, that's mm -hmm. interesting. Uh, yeah. I met I met this Venezuelan guy. Well, I've seen him many times in a gas station. And, you know, mm -hmm. I, I have bought him before and I told him. So, uh, you know, I told him, I never, I, I've seen you like four years ago. Mm -hmm. um, I imagine those, I, I imagine people like him, Bohemian, they move around, you know, then they go to Guatemala, they go to Mexico and they come back. And um, he told me, he said, well, yes, my intention, I, I left Venezuela because of the situation of Hugo Chavez and everything. Yes. So he said, my intention was to go to the United States. So I traveled all this time. And um, in El Salvador, I met a girl. She's now my wife and we have a daughter. Oh, that's interesting. So I've been doing this and now I save money. And now I brought my brother. And and now we're making uh, enough money to bring the mother. So that's oh, kind of cool. Right. It was a good story. So then, yeah, his intentions were to go to the United States, but he, he told me that Salvadorians are very beautiful. Oh, cool. And I said, yes, they are beautiful, but you are from Venezuela, man. <laughs> <laughs> I can see your point. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you know, I mean, they say that Venezuela is the capital of beautiful people, men and women. And he said, no. Nope. <laughs> he says, Salvadorian women are much prettier. I'm okay, good for you. <laughs> but maybe it was a sales tactic. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. All right, so um, Guillermo, can, can you tell me something you hate doing on your um, day off? Oh, let me see. I really hate uh, waking up early. On your day off? Yeah, on my day off. Yeah. Yeah, good. Okay, good. Rosie Bell, are you there? Yes, I'm here. Hi, Rosie Bell. Hi. Sorry I missed my class yesterday, but I was working real late. Oh, no problem. Where do you work? Uh, the name of the company is Textfield. Is what? Text to fill. Is it Text similar? Text to fill. Oh, but it's not mm. similar to Juana's. Uh, no, mm. they make fabric. Oh, uh -huh. okay. We make uh, knitting fabric. And where do you live? San Salvador. And by, where's by the, the company? Oh, the company is in Soyapango, Boulevard del Ejército. All right, so you travel by bus or by car? I travel by car every day. Can you tell me something you hate about traveling? No, nah, the traffic. <laughs> <laughs> of course, the traffic. traffic. <laughs> and yeah. yeah, because that takes a lot of time. Oh, yes. Me too, I hate driving and that, maybe that's the thing I hate the most in my life. I hate driving in rush hour. Mm -hmm. Yes, you're right. So do I. That's why, that's why I've been lucky. Everywhere I work, they, I always ask them, is there a possibility maybe I can work at six in the morning? <laughs> yeah, I mean, anything, anything, but I, I do not like to work from eight to five. And I know sometimes it's difficult because it's, it's the normal. Yeah, the works are but if there's any possibilities, yeah. They tell me, is it okay if you can go come in at five? Yes, please. <laughs> Where I used to work, I used to go in at five. It was so beautiful because oh. 10 minutes, it's like 
10 minutes, I go into the office. And, and the good thing is that all the bosses come in at eight. Yeah. So what I did is I go to my office and sleep. <laughs> sleep the two extra hours. It's like, oh, okay, good. It was the perfect job. <laughs> all right. Okay. Erica. Hello. Hi. Can you tell me something you enjoy doing with your family? Uh... I enjoy very much things, but my favorite probably is watching movies. <laughs> um, eat, go to the the park. I don't I don't know. Um, one more cooking maybe. Wait, uh, you enjoy watching movies with your family? Yeah, yeah. Good, and I'm sorry if I may ask, your family is, are you married or your family, mother, father, brother? And my favorite, my family is my mother and my cousin. Oh, okay, good. That's yeah, my family that's is, is small. That's something I hate doing with my family, watching movies. <laughs> <laughs> it's really, why? because I am a movie fan I love I am a really really big movie fan and um, for example I like watching The Godfather nice. like good movies that's nice great. nice <laughs> but then when it's family night with my family like my wife you know she likes watching The Notebook uh, rom I, I romantic your point. yes <laughs> yeah, I understand your point, point. but in my case it is very different because uh, we have the same prefer in movies or uh, TV shows uh, so it, that's no problem but uh, the... um, in December I suffered because okay. I watched every, oh, the Christmas. every possible Christmas <laughs> yeah, movie. I'm not a fan. <laughs> yeah. And you said your, your wife uh, very exciting and you very boring. <laughs> yeah, you know, that makes her happy. But I, at least the good thing is that we have um, smartphones now. Uh -huh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Enjoying the movie. <laughs> yeah, I, I say I have to be smart, you know, like. Okay, I let my wife watch it, and she thinks I'm watching, but I'm I'm actually on my phone. <laughs> okay, you're watching, but your cell phone. Yeah, but you know, when when it's time to eat, I choose. I'm sorry. When it comes to eating, I choose. Oh. So Is that's why. Cool? That's why. Yeah, when my wife says, "Hey, man, you always choose the movies. I will choose the restaurant." Oh, okay. <laughs> It's a good deal. <laughs> but you know why she says yes? Why? Because I pay. <laughs> <laughs> Don't like have power. options. Yeah, so at the end, I always, you know, she always wins. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> I understand. But you know, that's marriage. Yes. All right. Okay. Um, Let me share the screen again. Okay, teacher. Have you done the knowledge check yet? Mm. No. Okay, it says instructions. Rewrite the sentence using infinitive and gerund or gerund phrase. Remember to use capital letters and periods. So it says here, it's inappropriate to talk about politics at work or school. Mm -hmm. So okay. if we... Okay, good. Yeah, we have to start. Yeah. Talking about politics at politics at work. I'm sorry, at I said school or school at work or it's school. I have a doubt in in that case because for me it's inappropriate. Yes, yeah. it's actually yeah. inappropriate. They, they did it wrong. It's 
inappropriate. But if you write inappropriate, is wrong answer. Yeah. And I don't understand. It's a mistake from the system, so don't worry. But I mean, you did say it correctly. It's inappropriate. Uh, talking about politics at school or work, it's inappropriate. Can you give another example talking about politics? It's, oh, can you, it's inappropriate. Can you give another example? Inappropriate? Yeah. Okay. Uh, it's inappropriate to smoke at work. Mm. Okay. In public spaces. Okay. Criticize good. also. I'm sorry. To criticize other people when you are. Yes. Yes. In the or... Yes. Um, it's inappropriate to say lies. Okay. Very good. But I see a lot of people use. You like to use the infinitives, but remember, you can also use. Yeah. You can also use gerunds. Okay. Saying lies uh, is inappropriate. Yes. Saying lies. Oh. Saying lies is inappropriate. Um, mm -hmm. Laughing um, at people is inappropriate. Yes. Um, let me see. To children, uh, you, 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 this is actually more for our children, right? You say, look, son. Laughing at other children is inappropriate. Yes. May, um, uh, let me see. Making bullying. Bullying, uh, bullying kids is inappropriate. Bullying kids is inappropriate, okay. Well, actually there, no. I think because bullying inappropriate is like saying, okay, in this case, remember inappropriate is you shouldn't do that. But if you do, okay, be careful. Bullying is, is not acceptable. Yes. Okay. So I wouldn't say appropriate. Like bullying other kids is not appropriate. Mm -hmm. I would actually say a bullying children is intolerable. Yes. It's not acceptable. Yeah, okay, next we have, acceptable. yes. Next we have using certain gestures is impolite in some foreign languages. Uh, you see. So how do we it's, start? It's, it's impolite. It's impolite. In some foreign to countries? Use in, yeah, I would, I would start like this. In some, uh, in some foreign countries? In some foreign countries, foreign countries, yes. It's impolite. Is? It's? It's impolite. To use certain gestures. Yes. I Period. hate this. Oh, yeah, thank you. Appearance. The word, later. the word gesture is written down, right? Yeah. It has an extra yes. letter art, I think, it's gesture, not just gestures. Gestures, uh huh. <laughs> Yes. You know, we'll, we always have some issues to answer those. Uh, always, always. They are, even when we try it uh, on one way, so we correct them and we try and try and try, they are always wrong. They are wrong. Yeah. I always tell, I, yeah. I, I always tell my, my students, no se claven if you get this wrong, because <laughs> sometimes it's actually the system that's wrong. <laughs> yeah, right. Not you. Yeah. However, at the end, it's going to affect the, the score. Uh, yes, and... teacher. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> that's the problem. No, but they know. Oh, okay. okay, it says asking someone's age is often considered rude. Rude. It's it considered it's rude of to often consider rude to ask someone's age. Often, teacher. Wait, it's considered uh, rude. Or someone... it's. H. Mm, it's no, considered it's often rude. No, okay, it's hold on. often it says, considered. Okay, it says asking someone's age is often considered rude. So yes, it's okay. often considered mm -hmm. rude. It's often, uh -huh. Often, mm -hmm. yes, yes. Considered rude. Rude. 
to ask to ask someone else. To ask to ask to ask someone else. Someone please eliminate asking. Oh yeah, thank you. To ask someone someone age age period. Good. Yes. It's also considered rude to ask, to ask someone's someone. age. Yes, teacher. It's not, it's not unusual to be loved by everyone. It's not unusual in the US to address a professor by his or her first name. Uh, uh, addressing addressing, a addressing or her name. a professor, addressing, yes. Mm -hmm. addressing. Uh, ah, addressing a professor. Cap capital teacher, capital oh, DA. Yeah. Yeah. Addressing a professor by his oh, or Oh man, I hate that someone, someone totally changed my keyboard. Mm -hmm. Okay, so addressing. Addressing a professor, a professor by his, by his or her first name is not unusual in the United States. Addressing a professor by by his, his or, or first her name. first name is not is not, not unusual unusual right and you unusual in the U.S. in the U.S. point. I have a question. Have you ever seen the U.S. spell oh, no, like sure. this? Uh -huh. Yes. Teacher, and you, usually you, it's not correct. Yes, yes, I will change it right now. But do you know why okay. it's spelled like that? Uh, uh, e, 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 no. Yeah, because it's just the plural when you use the capitals. You know, sure, sure. Sure. Yes. Yes, because it's plural. E -E -U -U, yeah. Estados it's Unidos. Like in, it's like in Spanish when you say recursos humanos. R R H H. Yeah. Oh, mm -hmm. yeah. Okay. Next, it says hugging friends when you greet them is customary in many cultures. It's in many cultures. It's customary mm -hmm. in many cultures okay, to good. have friends. In many cultures. In many cultures. Customary. It's customary. Customary in many countries to hug friends. It's customary to hug friends. Hug your friends when you greet them. When you greet them. When you greet them. When you greet them. What's the meaning of when you greet them? Saludar. 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 Okay. Thank you. Hey, esta es otra que pueden usar. Miren, cuando uno dice good evening, you can say greetings. Mm. Nunca han visto tarjetas navideñas que people say happy greetings. Yeah. Yeah. Teacher, teacher, yes. I, yes. I think customary is not good. Uh, right. All right. Um, let me check. Uh, custom. I ah, no, you... culture. Culture. Culture oh, is sure. culture. Sorry. Culture. Culture is not right. Thank you. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Omit a. Okay. Thank you. Someone has changed my keyboard. So <laughs> from English to Spanish. Asking Amen. strangers if they are married is inappropriate in some countries. Mm, cool. It is inappropriate it is in some it countries. Is inappropriate in some countries. It is in it some is countries. Yeah. Strangers if they are married. 
is inappropriate. So look, in some countries, I would say comma. Is inappropriate to ask. Is inappropriate or married? You know like what I mean? Stranger? Yeah, copy paints, Maurice. Inappropriate. How do you pronounce in that one? Inappropriate. 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 Okay. Inappropriate. Five syllables. Inappropriate. Inappropriate. Okay. Inappropriate. So in some countries, it's inappropriate to to ask a stranger ask strangers if they are married. If they are married. Yeah. Okay, submit, so and I know we're gonna have them wrong. Yeah, <laughs> yeah because yeah. you're teacher. So you teacher. <laughs> I know. <laughs> oh, okay. But don't worry, this, this 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 will have to be fixed because only the uh, verb I think. Yes, um uh, this is gonna go into our is into our chat. Maybe it's only the verb. Do you want mm -hmm. to talk with someone to fix the yes the tomorrow? Picture? Tomorrow we're gonna have that because we have to report that. Mm -hmm. Okay. We have to report that. So listen, what do you do after class? Do you go to sleep? Or do you? Uh, I watch TV a little bit. And then in my I case, open. yes, teacher, because I, I need to to, <laughs> to wake up very early in the morning. At what 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 time do you wake up? Time? At five at five o'clock, teacher. Wow. And yes, because I I I go to my work at six six o'clock, and I prefer to be early for the traffic. Uh, I it's, totally it's, understand you. <laughs> yes, Santa Tecla to San Bartolo. Wow, mm, a lot yeah. of traffic. Yes, a long way. So every a day you way, travel. Right? Every day you travel to Santa Te to San Bartolo. Uh, only one day I I go to Santa Ana uh, today. <laughs> but normally you go to San Bartolo. Yes, yes, teacher. Or the office. My office is in Soyapango. Close to text to fill, mm -hmm. and and but I prefer to be at the facilities in San Bartolo. So then the good thing is that you make your own time. I I I am busy all time, teacher. Yeah, I imagine. All right. Yes. Well, what about the rest of you, the ones that don't work? What do you do after class? Watch TV. Oh, I work, oh. but I watch TV. A <laughs> lucky man. <laughs> you know, lately, lately I don't watch TV anymore. I just watch like YouTube Netflix. Netflix. because no, you know, I'm I'm starting not, I'm I'm starting really not to like Netflix anymore because there's nothing interesting yes, to, to watch yes, lately. Yes, there's nothing good to watch, and I spend I waste. Sometimes I waste 30, 40 minutes looking at what to watch. And yeah, that's oh. happened with me too. Mm -hmm. so, yes. so I just go straight to YouTube and, you know, start watching biographies or, or hey, I go to sleep. <laughs> or you go to like the illegal pages like Cuevana, Melispedia, and you start watching any movie. <laughs> wow. And it's free. And it's free. <laughs> and it's free. <laughs> yes, it's true. <laughs> okay. Uh, yeah. But you know, that's why Netflix is, and you know what I hate about Netflix? Like if you go to comedy, mm. 10 movies in the comedy are going to be in the same category in action and drama. So any category you go to, you will see the same movies. Yes. That's true. It's like one time I was, I saw like Forrest Gump. I mean, I even to say a comedy, like Forrest Gump. Action, blah, 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 Forrest Gump. What the hell is Forrest Gump action? I don't know. Drama. Because he, he, he runs. Hmm? Yeah. <laughs> That's the action, he runs. But you know, I oh. think I think Netflix, what they do at the, at the end, 
their objective is for you to watch what they want you to watch. Mm. Like that, that series, Looping. Did you watch that? No, I heard it. No. In my I case. It's boring. I, I didn't like it, but man, anywhere, Looping, Looping, Looping. So you end up, you end up watching it. Yeah. But it was, it was, I, I didn't like it personally. I haven't oh. tried because I haven't heard no one to say that it was a good. Well, yeah, I mean, the, the problem is like, it was, it was okay. I mean, it was, but you know, people are saying, oh my God, it's so good. And you know, <laughs> and it's, they, they say that it's kind of pajera. I don't know yes. how to say pajera in, Spanish, in English. It's a lie. <laughs> it's too much. Okay. Yeah, it is. It's just too much. <laughs> yeah. Okay, class. Thank you very much. I will see you tomorrow. Okay. Thank you, sir. Thank you, teacher. Have a good night. Good evening. No, now it's good night. Always is good night. Okay, bye-bye. <laughs>